Hello EV fans, welcome back to EV's gallery. Hope you guys are doing well. From the latest industry updates to in-depth reviews of the hottest EV models, we are here to keep you charged with electrifying news and insights. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. Volkswagen is one of those brands that is so well known and, you tend to imagine, so perennially successful that you'd think that once you go a foot in the door you'd be able to stay put right through until retirement. But in fact, it seems some of the company's employees might soon be looking for other work as VW tries to save itself from oblivion. Managers have reportedly told staff to expect redundancies as part of the automaker's strategy to save 10 billion euros, 10.94 billion dollars, and get itself back to full health in a rapidly changing automotive landscape where it's having to face increasingly aggressive rivals and changing customer tastes. The German automaker isn't having an easy time right now. It's losing market share in China, trying to avoid engaging in a price war with Tesla, and was forced to pause production of its EVs in Europe in response to sluggish demand for electric cars. Thomas Schaefer, CEO of the VW brand, as opposed to the VW Group, didn't mince words at a recent staff meeting telling attendees that the company was uncompetitive in its current state as a result of high costs and inefficiencies within the organization. With many of our pre-existing structures, processes and high costs, we are no longer competitive as the Volkswagen brand, Schaefer told a staff meeting at the Wolfsburg HQ, according to information seen by Reuters. Gunnar Killian, a board member for Human Resources, stated at the same meeting that reductions in the headcount would be possible by some employees agreeing to partial or early retirement. But he also explained that the majority of the 10 billion euro VW wants to save won't be clawed back through job cuts, but through other measures that will be outlined later this year. We need to finally be brave and honest enough to throw things overboard that are being duplicated within the company or are simply ballast we don't need for good results, Killian said, according to Reuters. None of this has come out of the blue. VW has been aware of mounting problems for some time, and in June of this year Schaefer told VW managers that the roof is on fire, warning them that we are letting the costs run too high in many areas. Volkswagen is recalled all of its 2023-2024 electric ID.4 crossovers with panoramic sunroofs in the United States few days ago. According to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, NHTSA, all Volkswagen ID.4 models sold with its glass roof option in the U.S. failed to meet fire retardant safety standards. In a letter written to VW, the NHTSA said, the interior sunshade for the panoramic glass roof may be insufficiently fire retardant. As such, these vehicles fail to comply with the requirements of the Federal Motor Vehicle Safety Standard No. 302, flammability of interior materials. Don't worry, this doesn't mean that the sunroof shade is going to spontaneously combust or anything. In the event of a fire, any interior material that doesn't meet fire retardant standards will only become additional fuel. Having fire retardant on certain interior materials just decreases the number of things that can burn, or at least burn easily thus limiting the size of the fire. Thankfully, it's a pretty easy fix and one that's covered by Volkswagen. All 23,883 affected ID.4 owners will have to take their car to their nearest VW dealer to have fire retardant applied to the sunroof shade, free of charge. Not all ID.4s are optioned with the panoramic sunroof but all models that do have the option were included in the recall. The ID.4's panoramic sunroof is just a glass roof with a roll-out sunshade, as the glass itself doesn't open. You can even open the sunshade with natural voice commands, such as telling the car that there isn't enough light in the cabin. However, currently, only ID.4s models NUP are available with the panoramic sunroof for 2024. Thanks for watching.